Hi everyone, you may have heard that the World Health Organization has declared coronavirus as a global health emergency. We've had lots of parents contact us to see if there's a way that they can help explain how to stop the spread of viruses to their children. And so we've come up with a really simple experiment that you can do at home. You're just gonna need a bowl of water, some pepper or some cinnamon, and some dishwashing liquid or some soap. So for this experiment first, we have to pretend that we can see viruses. Now viruses are obviously invisible, they're smaller than our eye can see. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take some pepper or something else that is fine grained like cinnamon and we're gonna put it on top of the bowl of water here. Now you see that the pepper floats to the top and we're gonna pretend that those are the viruses. Now viruses and bacteria are gonna be all over our hands all the time. And so what we're going to do is we're going to pretend that we're trying to wash those off by just washing or rinsing our hands in water. Now if I put my finger into this bowl of water, what you'll see is as I touch all the viruses, all the pepper here, and I pull my finger out, you can see that my hand is now covered in virus or pepper. It's a really easy way for your children to think about how their hands may be coated at all times. Now what you can see is rinsing my hand in water didn't actually clear the viruses from my hand. And so what we're going to do is explain to children why soap and water is so important. Okay, so I'm going to wipe these germs off, these visible germs. We're now going to repeat the experiment. I'm going to put a little bit more pepper on there. And this time, we're gonna add some soap to my hand. So I've just got some dishwashing soap here. You can use regular soap. And what soap does is decrease the surface tension and it's gonna help the soap and the water mix together to remove the oils from my hands and wash away the virus. So here I have a soap covered finger. We're gonna go back into our germs and take a look at what happens. You can see that the viruses are moving away from the soap. It's a really easy way to explain to your kids that using soap and water helps to move the viruses and the germs away from their hands as they're washing it in the tap. So beautifully visual to try and explain how something very invisible like viruses actually applies to your children's hands. So now we've taught your children about the importance of using soap, it's also important to teach them how to wash their hands thoroughly. And this is going to take about 20 seconds of time. So first of all, get your children to rinse their hands in water. Put some soap on the top and you're going to make sure that your palms are thoroughly rubbed together. Next, you're going to do the back of each hand. And then you want to go in between your fingers. The easiest way to do this is to interlock them and rub your fingers together. Now, important bit, tops of your fingers. You're gonna interlock your hands now and you're gonna rub your fingers here, making sure you've cleaned inside your nails. Make sure your wrists are also covered here. Don't forget your thumbs. So some people say that you should sing the song Happy Birthday twice, that's about the time you need. Um, it is longer than probably most of you are doing it. When you're finished, rinse off all the soap. The important thing here is rubbing your hands together because of the friction actually removing some of the oils and therefore the viruses and the bacteria. Final bit, make sure that you dry your hands with a clean towel to make sure that all of the bugs and the germs and the viruses actually have been removed. And there you go, a really easy way to teach your kids, number one, about why soap is important when it comes to getting viruses off your hands, and two, how to wash your hands nice and easily to prevent the spread of infection. <laughs>